Hello, I'm Andrew, the captain of the Kalara Rural Fire Brigade, and welcome to Karingai Fire Station, where the Kalara Brigade is currently based. This is Kalara 7, and today we're going to look around this truck. The Cat 7 is smaller than the Cat 1. It's lighter and more manoeuvrable, and therefore provides greater flexibility in accessing bushfire trails. This is the inside of Kalara 7. It's just like a Cat 1, except a bit smaller. We've got the radio to talk to fire control. We've got the crew protection system, thermal shields, blankets, everything else is very similar to the Cat 1. And in the back, there's room for a crew of six, but we think five is much more comfortable. Even though it's slightly smaller than the Category 1, we try to set it up in exactly the same way. Here on Kalara 7, we have the external suction lines and a very small portable pump. We've got one locker here with the hoses, the branches and the fittings. Around the back of Kalara 7 is the pump. Here we have the water tank, capacity 1,850 litres. The pump is here, the inlet for the uh, drafting, 238 outlets, control panel. Here is the water inlet for the hydrant. And this is the truck's primer. It's a bit different to the Cat 1 in that it's operated manually, which has the advantage of it being a lot quieter. And you're also able to feel when you've got prime through the resistance when you operate this lever. Around the back of Kalara 7, we've got one live reel, which is operated manually. We've also got a standpipe, a large fire extinguisher, a drip torch, and jerry cans with our drip torch mix. And the only locker on the driver's side of the vehicle has the first aid equipment, food for the crew, raincoats, and it's also got the only length of 65 that the truck has. And on the top of Kalara 7, we've got a box for our chainsaw equipment, some larger tools, and 225 outlets. 